We go out to the Chukchi Sea in March and April. We have a helicopter that's stationed on the coast of Alaska. We fly about 70 to 100 miles offshore and we are looking for bears to be able to sedate and collect data on. And we typically use tracks to find bears because the sea ice is white and the bears are white, so it's really difficult to find bears. And when we find a bear, if it's in a safe location, meaning that there's not um, a lot of water or hazards around, the bear's in, uh, healthy enough to be um, sedated, then we administer a dart that sedates the bear for about an hour. And then we are able to collect data, um, you know, basic health measurements like you would do if you went to a doctor's office. So get your weight, uh, get the length of the bear, how well it's growing, uh, determine its age, and, and collect a variety of samples to assess its health. The objective of that work is to try to understand the status of the population, how healthy it is, uh, but also try to understand how it's responding to sea ice loss. So the Chukchi Sea has seen uh, a large area of sea ice loss in the summertime, uh, and so a lot of our work is focused on trying to understand how that population is uh, coping with that change.